हेलो माई सेल्फ अनिमेश चतुर्वेदी आई एम फ्रॉम इंडियन इंस्टीट्यूट ऑफ टेक्नोलॉजी आई एम परसुइंग पी एच डी फ्रॉम देयर थैंकफुल दैट आई गॉट चांस टू प्रजेंट इन फ्रंट ऑफ यू इन आई सी डी एम टू थाउजेंड एटीन माई प्रजेंटेशन इज अबाउट सिस्टम एवोल्यूशन रिकमेंडर विच इज़ बेस्ड अपॉन ग्राफ एवोल्यूशन एंड चेंज लर्निंग नाउ विल प्रजेंट आर वर्क वॉट इज इवॉल्विंग सिस्टम एंड इवॉल्विंग सिस्टम इज a system which continuously change and evolve with time how constant growth affects this constant growth of a system makes maintenance a challenging task so improper utilization of entities may lead to inefficient maintenance there is a possibility of logical error and fault in newer component due to many developers working together in a project the study of system evolution can help to tackle these problems an evolving system can be represented as a graph of entity connections a set of entity are representing vertices where directional connection between entities are represented by edges by learning pattern of entity connections in various system states it is possible to recommend relevant and existing entity connection during system development learning changes in pattern of entity connection can improve component or entity reusability that save both time and effort for system development by team suppose a system becomes large and its pattern of entity connection become more complex this is due to evolution and changes in entity connection of connections over time all these tracking changes in pattern of entity connection is a challenging task this implies these changes in formation can improve connection which further makes future recommendation as a result machine learning techniques become an appropriate option that can learn the pattern of entity connections deep learning is a machine learning technique that forms deep neural network which is a type of artificial neural network inspired by biological system we aim to reconstruct matrix of system network which gives recommendation about system that can help in further system development and maintenance current state of art that is work related to recommender or predictive systems are as following castro etl5 described a recommender system that helps in challenging or dynamic evolving internet forum representing user profiles susto and others presented adaptive machine learning and regularized the reg- regression based method to support decision for flexible predictive for the system maintenance in proposed the temporal context aware recommender system for temporal context aware recommender system for analyzing user behavior in social media system that are influenced by intrinsic test and temporal context zen proposed dynamic context drift model using particle learning for time varying context multi armed problem rolf proposed use of random forest classification model to improve interesting measure the graph learning approach is applicable to the scenario like collective robot learning our system evolution recommender can be applicable to all such scenarios now we are presenting our approach system evolution recommender the approach is based upon graph evolution and change learning the system evolution recommender learns evolution based on changes happened among evolving system state suppose an evolving system has more than n plus 1 continuous evolving state such that we can use n state for training purpose and one remaining state for testing purpose retrieve n plus 1 states s1 s2 and up to sn and store them in a local directory this is evo recommender preprocesses 
a set of states to create a collection of n plus 1 graphs in the form of connection list with a mapping file. SysEvo recommend converts the collection of graph into n plus 1 connection matrices. A deep learning technique can be helpful in efficient learning of evolution in a system state series. To do this, we introduce graph evolution and change learning which processes the n connection matrices and produces an output matrix. The SysEvo recommend compares the output matrix with testing matrix, a matrix not used for training. System evolution recommender learns evolution happened over evolving state of a system at various time points. It makes the machine capable enough to understand the evolution in a state series without any explicit programming. The learned information can comment about evolving system. Graph evolution and change learning is the process of learning evolution happened over evolving graph from an intermediate representation that contain changing pattern of entity connections. It makes the machine capable enough to understand the evolution in an evolving graph state without any explicit programming. The GECL can do network reconstruction in the form of a connection matrix. The GECL may also be referred as Network Evolution and Change Learning NECL. The SysEvo recommend theory and approach creates basis for us to develop an automated tool named as SysEvo recommend tool. The tool helps in recommendation about system states, which reduces human intervention and effort. We developed the tool on Java. Our tool preprocesses evolving entity connection in evolving graph of system state series. After preprocessing, SysEvo recommend tool converts each evolving graph into a connection matrix. The tool has GECL which uses Deep Evolution Learner to generate Deep System Neural Network Deep SysNN. The tool uses GECL to reconstruct a zero matrix into an output matrix which helps to study the system evolution. Our tool learns and recommends the pattern of evolving entity connections over a state series. This helps to study and recommend about systems evolution. A practitioner dealing with evolving system which is represented as a series of graph with interconnected entities can find our tool interesting. An evolving graph represents connection between system entities. Our evolving system approach considers graph and evolution learning together and it adds a notion of graph or network matrix reconstruction. Our approach is an automated technique to build a recommender system with the proposed SysEvo recommend approach and tool. One can learn the evolution happened to a system over time. This learning can be used to do recommendation or prediction about system. Further, our tool would be helpful in making recommendation about system evolution in the following way. It can predict unknown connection between entities. It can help upgrading system to a new state. It ha is helpful further in intermediate phase of system development. It can assist a system developer. It can speed up the system development. It can do an automatic co correction of some error during system development. It can determine possible future of the system. These advantages are analyzed with the experiment over six evolving system. Now we present our experimentation. We formed evolving network graphs of six evolving system which are used to conduct experiment. 
the evolving network graph of six evolving system are based on four different domains we further converted these network to evolving connection matrix for training purpose using gecl graph evolution and change learning approach the gecl internally uses deep evolution learner approach we benchmark system evolution recommended tool for evolving system collected from six open internet repositories we collected data from four type of repositories wikipedia software repository uci repository and imdb these system data have rich state of time series history due to active contribution on them we use these data set because they provide many states to evaluate our system evolution recommender tool for each evolving system we made its combined matrix for the training purpose with gecl to study system evolution we use gecl by using model of deep evolution learner based on fundamental deep learning models like restricted boltzmann machine deep belief network and denoising auto encoder in addition to all these experiment we used these six evolving system to perform system evolution analytics as well as to calculate system network complexity so we are detailing uh, those two approach system evolution analytics is basically uh, there are two papers so two different techniques like using evolving systems we can use system network evolution mining system evolution information that can be helpful in summarized report generation and similarly different states of evolving system can be used for system graph evolution learning that can create a system neural network that can help in reconstruction matrix and that can make an evolving memory that helps in recommendation and prediction similarly this third paper that we have published is system network complexity uh, which mines subgraph and set of subgraph were used to uh, identify system state complexity and network evolution graphlet information and further third information is evolving system complexity this is the data set that we had used so basically evolving software is our first kind of data group sdfs is the kind of software repository that we use we created caller and callee procedures call graph and then we had used another domain as nature language which is collected from two different repositories of wikipedia with the page of list of bible translation and the page of list of multi sports event which is of 13 different states and the source biblical language and english variant language are the two columns on do that page in in our table so that are used to create a network which is a kind of word network similarly for multi sport event we used 13 states means 13 different uh decades and for bible translation 13 different centuries and for hadoop sdfs 15 different versions so basically title and scope of multi sports event is used to create word network and third fourth one is retail market in retail market we used product id and customer id to create a network of 13 different months so 13 different states are used and that we called the network we created is purchase network similarly from I, imdb movie generator system we had collected data set of imdb and created two different kind of data set based upon the uh, word list which has already published uh, a word list of positive sentiment and negative sentiment we created two different networks Uh, those uh, data set and the number of states used were 16 16 means 16 different decades so 
we created network between positive words in name and genre of movie similarly we created second type of negative sentiment uh, network from net negative words of movie name and genre so these two are the sentiment based uh, networks we had created in conclusion we we want to say that uh, this is just a abstract view of our approach and work in my phd thesis so in this short paper we presented system evolution recommender and which is based upon graph evolution and change learning that uses deep evolution learner which helps in doing matrix reconstruction so we built a tool of our approach and that tool will be helpful in doing system evolution analysis for six different evolving systems that we discussed these are the references so these references uh, are very important and small set of references that we had used uh, for this short paper abstract paper and you can further go for reading the three papers that we presented at different venues and we would like to thanks uh, all of you for listening this presentation and we especially wish to thank organizer of uh, the wonderful event and thanks all of you